It is uh, 4.15 in the morning. Still super early. There's nobody in this airport. That's what it is. On my way to Miami. And then a uh, quick layover in Miami. As we make it on our way to Panama. Pretty tired right now. Um, fortunate enough, um, I'm, I'm able to get into the Admirals Club, get uh, something to eat, a nice uh, cup of coffee, and um, kind of just waiting for my flight to uh, to board. But these are kind of cool uh, little luxuries that really help out when you're when you're traveling. And so. Uh, because I travel so much with American Airlines and I have status with them. Um, traveling internationally with the status that I have um, enables me to get into Admiral's Club uh, for the duration of the day, really. So no matter where, whether I'm, I'm right now I'm in JFK, when I get to Miami, I can get into Admiral's Club there as well before taking off to Panama. Um, so that's a pretty cool little lux luxury. It helps out, you can kick back, uh, free Wi-Fi, obviously some food, you can take showers. Um, just a kind of a, a good way to good way to travel. So if you don't already, if you're traveling often and you're using multiple airlines, I recommend that you stop doing that. Find an airline that you do enjoy uh, flying, customer service is good, um, you know, policies and all that stuff and uh, fly with them more frequently so you can jump on there their programs, their Advantage programs, um, so that you don't pay for bags and um, you get upgrades and, and little perks like this. It, uh, it comes in handy. So I'm just uh, finishing up my, that's some oatmeal, a little coffee, I'm about to knock down some yogurt and we'll be boarding in about 40 minutes. So the day continues. Ah, what's up, y'all? So here in Panama, in a city called Colón, it's a <clears throat> it's a port city. We're not too far from Panama City itself. It's about uh, about 40, 40 minutes away or so. And um, <clears throat> woke up this morning. It was a beautiful, beautiful morning out here. And um, I got a sound check at about two o'clock, which is just in a couple of hours. But before getting the sound check, I just kind of like to warm up the fingers and just kind of. Uh, I get I go through all my luggage make sure that everything is there TSA is famous for opening up bags I have my pedals and you know cables and stuff like that so I guess that freaks them out so they open it up and <clears throat> a lot of times they don't put things back the way they were um, they break cables I mean it's it, it, it could be a mess sometimes so I, I I make it a practice to go through my stuff once I get to the hotel just to make sure that um, all the pedals and all the cables and all that stuff is is still functioning and it's in the right place and make sure there's nothing missing before getting up to the sound check to the venue for sound check um, so right now i'm just kind of warming up just kind of no amp i didn't i didn't want to plug in i love i love just kind of playing um the bass and just kind of getting the natural tone from the woods and um the strings are fairly new i changed them about a week or, week or so ago so they have some good brightness to them and it's a great way to just kind of hear the articulation of, of the notes and um, knowing how hard or soft you're playing. And so uh, I, I do enjoy, you know, obviously plugging in and, and practicing with headphones on or in-ears on, <clears throat> but there's something about playing just kind of acoustically and feeling the vibrations of your bass and stuff. It just makes it a little more intimate. Um, so yeah, just kind of just hanging out in the hotel right now, waiting for the uh, for transportation to get here. And um, <clears throat> you know, just take some time to practice a little bit and get some warming up happening before we hit sound check. So uh, there's always uh, there's always good things happening. Roommate, 
uh, was that has been downstairs hanging by the pool. I was there early, it was cool, but um, I wanted to get upstairs and get my stuff ready, get my clothes, all that stuff kind of set up and ready to go um, so that I'm not rushing later. And I uh, pulled out the base, just kind of practice a little bit and to keep, uh, keep you guys informed as to kind of my routine when I'm on the road. Um, I love to go out and, and kind of sightsee, but um, uh, today was just uh, where we are physically, actually the location, it's not like a walking around type of area. It's a lot of uh, heavy traffic and um, not much to actually see. But um, probably we'll go later. I'll probably end up going later. Uh, we're talking about possibly going to the Panama Canal and uh, checking that out and seeing what that, that, that area looks like nowadays. And uh, we play later tonight. And then, uh, then we're hitting the road back home early in the morning. So it was really a, really a quick turnaround trip. Um, left yesterday morning. Uh, we're playing tonight, and then uh, we're back. We're back out tomorrow morning, and uh, then there's more to come. And we're hitting Argentina. We're gonna go to Argentina next week for a few days, and um, then we're going straight to El Salvador for another few days right after that. So um, more to come. More to come. Looking forward to it. Definitely uh, miss hitting the road. I definitely miss uh, spending time with my uh, my uh, travel family, my Ingrid Rosario family since we live in different cities and uh, we don't always get to, to hang and stuff. So it's always great to, to get together and just share, make music and uh, have a great time. And so, uh, yeah, that's about it. So I'm gonna keep on playing here and get some, uh, get the fingers warmed up and stretched out as we head to, uh, to soundcheck. And we'll bring you more from, from that area and kind of let you know how, uh, how my normal setups happen and, um, what we normally go through for sound check and stuff like that. So hang tight, more to come. What's up, y'all? Here we are with Henry Arias. Hey, Danny Martinez. Elevator status right here. <laughs> We're about to go to sound check. Let's go. Side event. So we're gonna get things set up here. Find a way to get to the stage. Colon, Panama. You heard it from the sound guy himself. Sometimes you get kind of rigged, things get rigged up. You do the best with what you can. You don't always get the best of everything. Although they did bring a, a, a montage, well hello. Lucky piano player, right? Here we are. There's Tony. Hey, what's up guys? So it is blazing hot out here. Uh, like 95 degrees. I'm through. Ah, man, I'm directly in the sun. Uh, so good thing we're playing tonight. Yeah. Evening, evening time, because it's it's hot out here. Panama. You know, hopefully get these streets filled with people and uh, play some amazing music and they can have a great experience. So we're still setting up, getting things ready. Run a sound check. Yeah. Stop with 39, keeping it real for you. Yeah, Tony set up on his drums. And I'm, I'm moving microphones inside of his kick drums. Thank you. You're welcome. 